Do you want to get good with PyTest? Here's a little taster of what is coming up in this PyTest video tutorial series. For starters, setup files are so last decade. I'll show you how to set up your pyproject.toml file using PyTest best practices. Writing and running your tests using PyCharm. You can use your gutter icons, your right click context menu, or your keyboard shortcuts to run your tests. Let's talk about that dirty little secret, skipping tests. You can annotate tests, and then you can see which tests were skipped. Checking that you're raising the right exception. You can add code that checks that the right exception is being raised. Creating setup code that you can share between your tests. We can annotate code with pytest.fixture, and then we can use this code in our subsequent tests. I'm going to throw some TDD into the mix. Let's see if it works for you. We'll see how we can test and code simultaneously and craft our tests against our code to get the test to pass. The debugger is your friend, regardless of where you are in the coding workflow. I'm going to show you how you can get comfortable with it and be more productive. We're going to go treasure hunting with the debugger so you can see just how useful it is when you're creating your tests. All this and more in the upcoming videos. You can scan this QR code to get more PyTest resources in the meantime.